the fraudulent accreditation exercise at the Federal University of Tokyo. Apart from being a vice chancellor with the most inferior qualifications, HMD, MBA, and PhD, to head a university in the history of Nigeria. Professor Set Akra Jaja also holds the infamous feat of being the most deceptive vice chancellor. Accreditation of programs is routine in most institutions of higher learning. The objectives are to ensure standards and to be certain that graduates of the institutions have not been shortchanged during their study. At Federal University of Tokyo, the team from the National University Commission, led by Dr. Kumo, was hoodwinked in the first quarter of 2018 to grant full accreditation to the following programs. Chemistry, Biochemistry, Microbiology, Computer Science, and Physics. During the first accreditation exercise in 2015, the programs listed above had interim accreditation. This implied that certain criteria, including staff, student ratio, laboratory, facilities, equipment, buildings, and space were not adequate for accreditation. However, the current Vice Chancellor, Professor Seth Akrajaja, and Deputy Vice Chancellor Prof. Teddy Adiers have introduced a new dimension into the decadence of university education in Nigeria. The university did not engage staff during the period nor purchase new equipment since the 2015 accreditation. The office space and accommodation in the Faculty of Science building, which became an annex for the exercise, suddenly enjoyed a cosmetic touch. Then came the ingenuity of the unscrupulous police officer and dishonorable naval man turned emergency academics, namely the duo of Professor Set Akra Jaja and Professor Teddy Adias, respectively. From the bag of chicanery and obvious lack of patriotism to the country, they spent millions to produce emergency manuals, recruited temporary staff backdating the appointments to at least six months, and temporarily commandeered the new Faculty of Engineering complex, which for the period became the Faculty of Science main building. The most solid part of this unpardonable offense is the fact that full professors from other institutions were corralled for filthy lucre to be accomplices in sending the wrong image to the university's undergraduates, who came to increase in knowledge and observe character building. Note that graduates are awarded degrees for learning and character. Some of the external professors who participated in this fraud to deceive the team from the NUC were Professor Adeyemi, Federal University of Petroleum Resources, Professor Virginia Ejiofo of Namdia Zikwe University, Dr. Audu of Niger Delta University, Professor Agbakoba. Needless to state that the listed programs got full accreditation, a short changing of the true meaning of good academic training and standards. More painful to realize that the trumpeters of sanitization of the academic system are the same people that have plotted this shame to a national institution of higher learning in which taxpayers have invested huge sums of money. FU has a Directorate of Research and Quality Control, headed by a newly promoted professor, Professor Mrs. Ihelma Adekule, a chemistry professor. One wonders what control and influence the Directorate had in this immoral act to deceive the NUC. The NUC and the Federal Ministry of Education are urged to investigate this blatant act of demeaning the standard of education in this country. Professor Jaja and Professor Adias, the masterminds of this disgraceful act, should be investigated. 
removed from office and prosecuted to the full extent of the law. They are not worthy to head any sort of higher learning in Nigeria.